What's up everybody, peace keep today for you guys, welcome back to the Town Hall 12 where we clan games have been completed. So let's collect some clan game rewards. So we have the full map, we have maxed out um, our tiers and we'll be able to actually collect our second reward um, on a single tier. So for the first tier, got a money elixir and some gems. Um, at this point, I have a decent amount of gems, but I'm still going to settle. I'm actually going to settle with the elixir on this one. Um, I know I can farm that elixir in a single boost, but I'm going to settle with the elixir for this one um, as well. I think I didn't think it's that bad. Next off, there is a shovel, and then there's some gold. I have four shovels already. I don't need another one. I normally would just sell my shovels. Um, but I, but I'll take the loot. I think the loot is not going to be the worst thing out of the world. But normally I would take a shovel. And to actually combat that. Next off there is some war rings. And some gems. I'm actually going to take the gems over the war rings. I know that's pretty weird. Um, considering all of the war upgrades we do have as you guys can see. But I think I'm just going to settle with the gems on this one. Next off there is some elixir. There's a a potion there is a super potion and some elixir i'm gonna actually settle with the build a potion but the potion knocks off a lot of time off of your upgrades especially when you have five or six builders going a build a potion does pretty well so i'm gonna go with the build a potion next off there is uh some dark elixir not really needed i already have research potions so that's all the question i'm actually gonna go through war rings this time it's eight war rings um, just basically stocking up war rings. I know I didn't go through war rings on the third tier. I went with the gems, but eight war rings on this um on this one is more suitable for me than the dark elixir um as well. Next off is the last and final tier, the book of spells, a rune of gold and a hundred gems. We'll be collecting the rune uh, for the first round of uh, of rewards. And then we will collect the last one. So we'll collect those. And now let's collect the book of spells. Isn't the best book? Yes, it isn't the best book. But sometimes you're going to have to settle with what you can get. So we'll be collecting the last um, the last reward. And it's the book of spells. So you can see we have four gems. Um, some gold, elixir, the book of spells, the rune of gold, eight war rings, and the builder poster. So GG. To everyone actually completing and ended up being six on the clan uh, finishing uh, clan games as well which is awesome so we're actually gonna hop into an attack or do one before we end off the video here um, just hopefully we can find some loot we do need to keep farming as well um, farming has been a little bit slow um, during clan games um, but hopefully we'll be able to find a ton of loot and I haven't been doing much attacking on the 12 as I normally would. Just been pretty busy with doing other stuff. Um, but this is really all we can do. So if we can find a decent amount of loot um, as well. Uh, we like I said, we need a ton, a ton of loot. The book of spells probably, like I said, isn't the best book. But you're going to have to take what you can really settle with uh, for right now. Hopefully next clan games, next month. Is actually going to be the better uh, reward. So, okay, we have a town 12. And this one is actually not too bad. The some of the gold elixir, he is boosting as well, uh, which is good for me. So, hopefully, I probably may have to do the same um, boosting for resources, especially if I'm not going to be able to play um, a good amount of time like I normally would. Um, but hopefully, that doesn't have to come to that. And we can actually keep farming. Um, as normal, so I'm gonna actually try to soup. Um, sorry, I'm gonna try to war break my queen into this compartment. Um, just to hopefully get the air defense all the way. Both air defenses, she is gonna go into a single two, which is the worst part. Um, but I'll drop a big dragon over on the right hand side of the of the queen to actually basically push her into the single, and I can actually jump her in. The only thing is, I will have to use the um her ability so ice column down the base column um i'm actually going to use the wrecker as well 
I'll jump in and I'll use the Queen's ability and I'll drop the Warden down as well and I'll drop the Valkyries. I probably should have funneled over here a hundred percent better. Um, but oh she they are turning around which is good. Rage and heal in. The Warbreakers I dropped in just um got into the base. Hopefully the warden can go where the king is, but he isn't. Uh, so there, so the king is gonna eat up some of the eagle shot. So I'm gonna drop the raid spell, a pre-purpose raid spell for the troops on either side of the wall. We still have the warden's ability. I will pop the warden's ability now. The eagle just went down to the uh, my queen, so we do have. Oop! I dropped another archer over there to get murdered. So I'm gonna drop the. Poison on the queen. My queen is gonna die because I had to pop her ability through that single, and the warden is just eating away at her life. A warden does so much damage, um, on defense. So I'm gonna drop a minion over on the left hand side, really with the king, and my queen is going to die. Yeah, she is gonna die. I kind of use a rare spell, but I think it's better to save it, uh, so I don't have to keep requesting for one. So the king and Pekka is at the top. Uh, so the base, we still have an ice column left and the healers are still on the, um, ice, healers are actually on the ice column, so we probably could triple the, the king did go down though, the warden is still alive, the warden is actually fighting his way, but it seems that he is going to go down, because the healers are not on him, and the healers are on the ice column that is going to perish, uh, right now, so I'm going to end it off here, it's going to end off, the minion is still alive though, but, we're not going to get much because he is on the king. He isn't on anything um, worth getting. He isn't going to be getting any of the loot, which is sad because he has two bits of storages that are up. Um, but he's not damaging them. So I'm going to end it off 93%. I'll take it nonetheless. And decent amount of loot. But that is really it for this video. We do get a star bonus as well. We do have some more star bonuses that I will definitely try to go and get. Um, but I hope you guys did enjoy this video, collect any clan games, doing a single attack. Um, but I hope you guys did enjoy, like I said, and I'll see you guys next time.